What's up guys, Mr. Allen C. This is our daily devotion, Wake Up to the Word by Joyce Meyer. This has 365 devotions in it. Today's is for June 24th, so let's read it. This is called Accomplish. <laughs> I gotta clear this camera up, there we go. Accomplish, to complete, to finish entirely. One of the reasons many people do not enjoy life or miss out on some of the blessings God wants to give them is that their lives are cluttered and with unfinished projects. They never taste the joy of accomplishing a goal or fulfilling a desire because they do not press past the challenges that arise. Every person has an excuse bag. I know I got an excuse bag. Boy, it's a really nice one too. It's a high name brand. It's a little invisible accessory we carry around with us and when something that seems difficult arises, challenging us or giving us more than we want to deal with, we pull out the old little excuse bag. Dang, to it and we do. That is that is just too hard. I don't have enough time. I don't have anyone to help me. I'm afraid. I urge you to throw away your excuse bag. Go get a can-do bag. And fill it with biblical faith-filled reasons you can accomplish what you want to accomplish in your life. To Second Chronicles 7.11 Thus Solomon finished the Lord's house and the king's house, and all that he had planned to do in the Lord's house and his own house, he accomplished successfully. Alright guys, so this was a lot of uh, back and forth, but pretty much go through with your goals, especially if it's something in your heart that you think you need to complete Complete it. Things will come up. Things will arise that are difficult. Complete it and just keep trudging forward. You're going to be happy and you're going to see the benefits of completing what you set out to do originally. Um, also, you know, ask Bill Gates, ask billionaires. These guys don't give up on their goals. They complete their goals. And once you go so far, you can see further. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.